I drive from downtown Houston each day and listen to the radio. So that gives me enough time to kind of clear my mind, get ready and get excited for a new day. I'm currently the facility support squat lead for the Thunder Horse facility, and I'm based in the Houston Westlake office. So I've been with BP for 17 years. I've been in my current role for about four years. So my role entails leading uh, a team of top size and subsea engineers to provide technical support to our offshore facility. In terms of risk management, how do we make sure that the team offshore goes home safely? And then also, how do we help optimize uh, production as well? How do we make the facility as efficient as it could be? And then I would also say we support our energy transition in terms of getting to net zero. Um, so we are accountable for delivering a number of projects that reduce our emissions. The pace of work is very fast in operations, so it requires us to have teamwork and to collaborate. Because I like each day to be a little bit different, it keeps it fun, it keeps it exciting, that keeps me motivated um, and keeps me on my toes. The best bit of my job is definitely the people that I get to work with. We are really encouraged to bring our whole self to work and to get to know each other on a personal level so that we can care for each other and support each other. That diversity is what makes such a great organization. I currently have five mentees at BP, and I provide um, advice and experience and also just provide a listening ear. And it's because I had so many mentors in my career. So it's a very uh, supportive culture um, and a very open door culture at BP. The next generation of BP leaders are going to be people who enjoy working through challenges as one team. They're people who are excited about the energy transition and doing their part to get to net zero. For anyone who's interested in joining BP, I would say come. We would love to have you. We would love to have your talents and it is probably one of the best decisions you will ever make.